I picked up Goose, this is a Dreadnought 32, um, during Christmas 2015-16 um, in uh, Fosdyke Marina, uh, Norfolk, near uh, Boston. And I got it down here a couple of months ago, well, uh, during May. I'm just in the process of fitting her out and getting all the electrics done on her. And uh, go sailing. She's based on a Tiki Ketch, an American design, and also um, very popular over there. And um, Goose, that's her name, was also built in uh, America and the California coast just uh, outside north of Los Angeles um, in 1975. So it needs an engine, it needs rewiring, the mast in particular. Um, but I'm actually just making it habitable at the moment. And... Uh, this is it. I'll show you what it is. Now she's a long keel, fat bodied, but uh, sails probably quite well upright. I'll be actually working on the deck today. And the hull. The blue of the decks I'll turn to white or cream. It's a nice long bow spit. I've got to sort out the hatches. There she is there. The best of you there. I've already had a go at the spreaders with the wire wool, so you can probably see on the right hand side the uh, spreaders uh, clean of muck, or on the left they need doing. Just wanted to see if the wire wool would work. Old style tiller. Just shows you how durable fiberglass is, is that the aluminium clasps that hold this hatch together are all just rusted away but the uh, fiberglass is still there. <clears throat> the interior. I'm painting it mostly white with varnish trim. Got my stuff out. Yeah, that's where the cooker will go. And the cold store is there. Probably see it better if I went in. Just needs tidying up. It's not too bad. And that's my storage area for food. Two sinks. Just two double berths and two single running berths. There's the cockpit area, which I'm the uh, chart table area, which I've more or less sorted out. In the back, there's the double berth. You see it better if I come this way. So the double goes up there. Room for storage. And the four peak is white with varnish trim again, just brightening it up. The electrics are going to be fun. I'll be more or less starting from scratch, but there isn't a lot of electrical stuff on this boat, so. 
shouldn't be too much of a problem. There we go. There we go. Where are we where are we storing all my clothing and everything else? Again, just needs uh, some tidying up and uh, add a sea toilet there. And that's the toilet area sorted. So not in bad condition at all. When I first got it, she was really quite poor. toolkit over on one side there. Also over here. I had a wide angle lens. I'll make use of that but I don't. Coming back. So it'll be a bit of a squeeze to get into the chart table, but once you pass the ladders, you'll be in good enough. And uh, yes, not expecting any real problems there now. Once finished, should be a nice boat. And that's it.